Good morning everybody happy Friday I have the day off I'm so excited um, I want to show you guys this milk frother that was sent to me um, not sponsored they just sent it to me asking me if I want to try it and I said of course you guys know I love my coffee and I love fancy coffees um, and I thought this morning would be a great time to try it because I'm out of like regular creamer like you know the one that I use the Califia farm so I thought we would try frothing some milk um, I haven't used it yet. I did just open it just to see how it looks. Um, so it comes with the milk frother. Wow, this one's pretty. Um, here's the lid. It gives you the lines on the inside. Maximum, minimum. Max. I don't know. I think one of these means like hot and cold. Because there's two max lines. Because you could froth this hot or cold, which I think is really, really cool. If, like, you're doing iced coffee, um, you could do it cold so it doesn't warm it up. Um, ooh, this is cool. I think it's to clean it because if you look down in there, the um, this is what goes fast. I guess this is to clean that out. I could be wrong. <laughs> Let's see what else is in here. Um, this is the base, I'm assuming. You put this on here to get it started. What is this? Oh, the directions. Maximum. Oh, that's what that means. The little lines. Thank goodness for this. So um, that's the maximum level mark for milk frothing. And this is the maximum level for just heating the milk. Okay. So you don't want to go any higher than that. This, I don't know if you guys can see it. See that line? There's three lines. This one's in the middle. If you're going to froth your milk. Oh, I guess you could just heat it too if you want. Cool. Whisk for heating the milk. Where's that one? Comes with directions. Oh, here they are. Um, then there is an attachment, I guess, if you just want to heat the milk, and then another um, whiskey thing, I guess. I don't know what you call these. But that's really nice that they send you an extra one. So um, let's pour some coffee. Rob left me his debit card. I don't want to show you that number. <laughs> Shoes are everywhere. I'm going to go get my nails done today. That was his coffee from this morning. I did already have a little bit. So let's refill this. I'm not going to fill this up all the way because, you know, when you froth the milk, it gets kind of frothy. Add a little sugar just because this creamer is just milk. All right, let's bring this on over. Okay, let me set this up. Plug this in, and we're gonna pour in a little milk. Okay. Um, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you see that um, the people that I work for on the weekends, what is stuck in there? There's like something stuck. Cut it out, it's just plastic. Um, they have an espresso machine and I've been using it every time I go there at night because they have the milk frother that goes with the Nespresso machine. And I've been putting in, um, they always have that Coffee Mate, like the natural one. And I put it in the milk frother and it is <laughs> so good. It's, it's clearly more than like you're supposed to use for creamer, but um, it makes the coffee delicious. So you don't have to add any sugar. Okay, so I've got that in there. Let's um, broth it up. I don't know which one I'm supposed to use. Let's read the directions. Okay. Button for milk frothing and heating milk. Okay, we're going to use this button. Oh, it's so quiet. There it goes. Let's see how long it takes to froth it up. I wonder if it turns off automatically or like you have to shut it off. Let's see what happens. I wonder if the instructions give us whole milk for best results. We've got reduced fat milk, whatever. Keep the whisk in a safe place. Okay. I mean, cool instructions. It doesn't tell me how long this goes for. So I don't know if it's just going to shut off or we're going to have to shut it off. Look how frothy it's already though. Ooh, I'm so excited for this. It doesn't get hot, it doesn't feel hot, so that's nice. 
you got I only ever use this whisker like a hand whisker this one's from Ikea um, and it works pretty good just like to put it in there but it doesn't froth it up like this then again I've never really used it with milk I wonder if it's gonna shut off I don't know if I have patience to wait to see if it just shuts off when it says that it's done getting all steamy. All right, let's shut it off. I don't have patience. <laughs> it could my it could just go. Who knows? <laughs> Look at that. I bet I could have frothed it longer and it would have been frothier. Oh, I'm so excited. I love this thing. I am going to get back in bed and enjoy my coffee because I'm I was gonna go to the gym this morning, but my friend, um, here, you can see my face. <laughs> All in its morning glory. Um, let's try this really quick. Oh, it's hot. <laughs> Oops. Um I was I had every intentions of going to the gym at nine o'clock. But I texted my friend who I'm meeting up with later to get a manicure pedicure. I was like, I just don't feel like going to the gym. She's very pregnant. So um, she's like, let's just go for a walk later. I'm like, all right. I'm going to get back in bed till 10 o'clock. Oh, my gosh. It is so creamy. Oh, I'm so excited. Mmm. A little cinnamon on that would be really good too. Um, and the really cool thing about this Ninja coffee bar thing that I have is like I could just make... Um, there's like a button on it for um, like especially concentrated coffee um, so it like makes like a shot of coffee I've done this before um, and then you could make like yourself a latte I'm like all set for all the coffee things <laughs> but <clears throat> I'm gonna clean this thing out I think it's very easy to clean because it comes off of the um, the stand so you just rinse the whole thing under water which is really cool that's how like the Nespresso one is too so I'm assuming it's the same I don't I don't know um, but I will have that in my Amazon store if you guys are interested no big deal if not uh, my coffee maker is also in there um, but yes happy Friday I'm gonna get back in bed until it's time to go get an oil change I'm making breakfast I'm having I'm not making breakfast really I'm putting it together I gotta charge my camera um, some yogurt this yogurt I'm obsessed with I love that it is good ingredients there's only two grams of sugar I think there's only three carbs in here it's pretty good it's only two points and I'm gonna put I'm trying to grab a banana with one hand I'm gonna cut up a banana and my new favorite granola I'm gonna put two tablespoons of it. I'm obsessed with this granola. It is so delicious. It's gluten free. Can I open it? I actually keep the tablespoon right in there. So I'm just gonna put two tablespoons of granola. Two tablespoons is two points. And then I'm gonna chop up the banana and mix it all together for a nice four point breakfast. The coffee was three, I believe. So seven points all together for breakfast. Doesn't that look delightful? It was only half of a banana. I didn't use the whole thing. Um. Hello guys. So it's the next day now. I think I'm just gonna like try to combine as much as my weekend as I can together. Um, I tried to do like yesterday, but like my friend and I went like into like town where I live and it was just crowded and I always feel so weird pulling out the camera like when there's like a lot of people around. So I'm just gonna like combine today with yesterday's and see what kind of video we end up with. Hopefully I can charge my camera at my dad's. So my dad went to Nashville <clears throat> and I'm going over there so I can help my mom get my brother out of bed and be a good helpful sis. Um, and then tonight we have my, my sister's having like a barbecue, so it's kind of annoying to go there this morning and then to go back, but you got to do what you got to do for family, right? So, um, after I'm done here, I'm making potato salad for the barbecue tonight and then I have to, um, go back home. I need to stop at Target. I ordered, um, my nephew a gift on eBay 
I was just like, right now he's into, I have a nephew who's like, he gets very into specific things. And I was like, John, what do you want for your birthday? And right now he's really into Alvin, Simon, Theodore, and Dave. He wants all of it involved. I can't find anything that includes Dave. So I found like a puzzle. It's like one of those puzzles that, I think it's like four puzzles in one. I don't remember, but I ordered it thinking like, <laughs> Great, I ordered it like last week. It'll be here like in no time. I was like, your estimated arrival date is like June 13th. I'm like, what? So um, I texted my sister-in-law and said, I I really put in some effort here, um, except the gift won't get here in time. So at Target, um, I saw on their, on like the app that they have, um, they have a pool, an inflatable like ba floating basketball hoop. And then like you throw the, basketball into the hoop so I thought that would be fun for the pool and then I'll give him his puzzle a different time um <clears throat> so I have to set a target yeah I got my nails done yesterday I love a fresh mani can you see I have a camera on this there we go uh, the toes are the same color too I don't know the color I know it's an OPI color I'm bad at that um, but yeah, that's what we're doing. Um, at some point I might need to be making some cookies. I always make cookies for anybody's house. The kids love my cookies. So we'll see what the day brings us. Making a cup of joe. Got some eggs just about done. Oh gosh, that one cracked. Um, to put in some water for some potato salad. And it's just me and my bro right now. Okay, Google, what time is it? Hello, bro. Hi, sis. Uh, may I borrow your charger? For what? My camera. There it is. Thanks so much. Oh, that's the iPhone one. May I please borrow this? I don't know. What are you going to give me, sis, in return? I'm going to get you out of bed. You're welcome. Got him in his chair. I'm a successful sis. Woohoo! Woohoo! Not a lot of sisters would do this. You should feel very appreciative. Don't you? Don't you? Bro. Shh. You're such a jerk. Gina won't watch the light. I saw the light. When? We did in here. Oh, <laughs> you're so silly. Hi, baby girl. Yay, Sally's a baby again. Go away, dog. Dallas, go lay down. Dallas ate my flip flops. Right, James? He ate my other Tory Burch flop. These lasted forever. I'm so upset. They were totally worth spending $50 on. But I figured out how to fix it and how to do it together. I already I threw it out. Because oh. you know what it was, James? I loved your idea, but she bit into the flip flop. There was holes. Mm -hmm. Sassy dog. What's Bells doing? Are you a baby? Where's the monkey? So where's the monkey? Oh, 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 ah, 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 ah. Oh, 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 ah, ah. She just didn't eat you up. Oh my God, this dog. Sure can. Holler at ya. I'm not done yet. Oh, <laughs> okay. She's stealing tables and chairs for a barbecue tonight. Who's my belly booze? <laughs> That's a fun potato salad going. I've got my potatoes in here, salt and pepper. I've got celery cut up, onions cut up. I cheated with the bacon and bought this. Chopping that up. I've got my eggs. I've got to cut. And then you literally just mix it all together. It's like to die for. Here it is all done. Now it just has to chill. And this is the best potato salad in the world. Hey guys, I'll look at Buster. Um, I found these cute little bow scrunchies. I haven't owned a scrunchie in years. I am home now. I just went to Target. I tried to film like in the store, but it was crazy. I just got like things we needed. Like right now I'm obsessed with seltzer. So I got a new flavor, like that bubbly brand, mango thing open all the way um just like things I needed new makeup removing wipes the browns um nothing like fun and exciting just like stuff we needed my camera's gonna die but my house is like crazy mess right now 
so I'm gonna like tidy up a little bit and then kind of just relax um I might just end the video here because we're gonna go to my sister's later and I don't think I'm gonna bring my camera um I haven't really eaten much today I had a bowl of cereal at my mom's um I really needed to focus on getting back on track I've been like out of control yesterday we had um with my friend we had that lunch you saw but with fries and then we went and got ice cream afterwards I just feel like I don't know what it's gonna take mentally to get me to focus on tracking and eating good because I know what to do I don't need like a new plan I don't need anything like that I just need to like mentally get there and I'm hoping Monday because we have nothing to do I could meal prep I could just get like mentally there you know what I mean like there's so many things that you know you have to do to get yourself to lose like I I've been saying this for months probably a year I really just need to lose 10 pounds and now's the time because we're taking some time off of um IVF right now we have a few months break and it's just, just like if it's not now then when um I am contemplating a whole 30 I just don't know if I have it in me I might need something like that I'm still thinking about it not even sure like when I would start it um, just to like reset my body but I'm also going to try this week to track every single day and film as much as I can and post as much as I can because the more I'm posting and the more I'm filming the more accountable I am and the better I am um, I'm going to let Buster in start cleaning thank you guys so much for watching this video don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have any if you haven't already don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video bye